Hey everyone, what's up, Rific, and welcome back to another video. Now, this video is very different, as you can tell by the title, and I know it's kind of random out of nowhere, but I decided to just make a video on this because I felt like it. I was contemplating making a video like this ever since last night, but today I was like, you know what, why not, just because I want to. And yeah, uh, as you can tell by the title, my basement got flooded, and if you didn't know, that's where the, well, it wasn't like a huge, huge flood, but it was yeah like water got everywhere and the floors got destroyed and it's like stuff that were in rooms got washed over and whatever whatever it was not a pleasant time it was like i remember like last night i was literally playing we boxing i was also beating everybody I was trying to see if i can make it to the mat because i think he's like the last guy in we sports that everybody talks about him being like the hardest to beat and i was doing pretty good i haven't taken any losses or anything i was doing straight and i look over by my pool table and i look under it and i see like a reflection of light coming off from there and it's like the floor looked very glossy but then i realized there's water i'm like what and i stepped forward and i was on the carpet mind you and once i stepped forward it like when i i touched like the edge of the carpet and sorry if i'm stuttering everywhere i'm doing this unscripted but i stepped on the edge of the carpet and then the thing just sunk and then water just came up I was like whoa and then i look around the place and i realize that the laundry machine rooms uh floor is flooded and when i stepped on the styrofoam mat then that started flowing. I was like, whoa, this is not good. So I quickly went upstairs, told my cousin, told my bat, this is bad, told my dad. We came down, looked at it, and realized we were in for quite a night. So my uncle came down, my other brother came down. First, uh, we started uh, just, like trying to see where the source of like where the water was coming in from because it was like a very nasty uh, rainstorm last night. I don't know if you guys know. But over here in like Jersey, New York, it was terrible. Like, I didn't even know like what New York was going through until I checked the news this morning. But I'll get to that a little later. Still on my problem. So we decided to try to figure out where like the source of where the water was flowing in. It was coming in from the laundry room from this pipe. It was like in the bottom of this pipe. There was like this little thing when water was just like slowly getting. But I guess it was flowing long enough. And for me not realizing because I was like I had my headphones in. I was listening to the Donda album while. I was playing Wii Sports, so I don't think I would have heard the water anytime soon. But anyway, figured out where the source came from, went outside, made sure all the windows were closed and all the possible ways the water can get in, they couldn't get in no more. And then we got on our boots, we got like these uh, buckets and scrapers, and we started like scooping up water and then throwing it into like the laundry room toilet because when you just dump a whole bunch of water in there, it just all goes down into the source system, whatever, whatever. So we spent hours down there and yeah it was not fun it was very tiresome uh, my back was hurting my legs were hurting my knees were hurting my ankles were hurting <laughs> it was a lot of work a lot of manual work and it's funny too because i was like one of the one nights where i was deciding to like you know what let me actually get in my bed earlier today like early today even though it was like nearing 10 o'clock i just want to finish my Wii sports uh boxing match like it's like if i lose i was gonna get up and go but luckily i didn't get up and go because who would have known how much worse the basement would be and if i wasn't down there that late at night so yeah, that was the thing. We spent majority of the night just like all the way till one in the morning. And then we decided to take a break, just scooping out water. So we went to bed, woke up this morning, started doing it again, and we got a like better progress. So we got all the carpets and the styrofoam mats. We put them outside in the sun to dry. So while they're doing that, we're just mopping up the basement floor. And yeah, this has been pretty hectic. And yeah, when I decided to make my breakfast this morning, I looked at the news and realized that New York's going through it too. I've seen that like the train stations are like going through it, uh, cars. Like the whole streets are filled with water and like wow i like and what i was doing last night like it was bad but it wasn't as bad as if it was like a, a huge flood but i'm like thinking like wow i think this is bad and like just think about what the people in louisiana are going through they're going through a whole hurricane floods no power and evacuating and it's like wow but yeah it just goes to show that it doesn't matter what you're going through there's always someone who's going through worse but yeah this was an experience and the funny thing is it's not even the first time this happened I think the first time we got a flood over here, I was a kid, and I guess my parents took care of it. They didn't even let me know until after it was over. And now I'm dealing with this. I'll, the only uh, good thing that came from this flood is the fact that I get to miss a day at college. Like the college is closed, and I already complete all my homework, so I don't have to worry about anything. And plus, I mean, I was going to. I don't even know if I'm going to live stream today because the base was still down there. We still got work to do. But yeah, I was planning to play a few games and get some stuff in since I had some free time, but I guess. I'm just gonna make this quick video for you guys and just watch YouTube all day because I don't even I can't even uh, record tomorrow because I got a doctor's appointment but I can still get a video up because I still have one scheduled but yeah 
All right, I had to do a quick cut there because cousin came in and we still have more work to do, so I gotta hurry up and finish this off. But I think that's everything. Um, also, if you guys are wondering what the background gameplay is, it's uh, a 1v1 between me and obviously you see his name tag. But he was uh, a person that commented on my uh, Minecraft PvP video when I was just starting out to upload again, like back in January. And he subscribed to me and stuck around, and I upload a few of Minecraft videos and PvP ones, and seemed to comment a lot. And I decided one day, hey, let's just add each other on Xbox in a 1v1. I was like, maybe I can make a video on it, or put, put in a montage. And he was like, okay, and then we did it. This was back in May. This is the footage you're watching, this was recorded back in May. I had this video just sitting here back in May. And it's not the only match that you're seeing. I had multiple recordings of it, but I decided to use this as background gameplay, because I didn't feel like it was good enough. But there was some good combos in here and whatnot, but the game, like, the PvPing was just wacky. Like... I haven't PvP in a while, so I was rusty, as you can obviously tell, getting smacked around in the lag. But yeah, that's what happens with that. I might just uh, either save these clips for something and maybe actually make it to a video, or just use it for a, a PvP montage that I might make in the future. No promises, though. Also, one last thing. Obviously, I have some stuff in there. I have my games and my recording equipment down in the basement, so I decided, just in case this place floods up in the middle of the night, I'm going to take some important stuff with me. So I took my laptop took my capture card into my microphone and then I was looking at the consoles I decided to leave them down there because I know the water was gonna rise that much but I decided I was like just playing doing this hypothetical game like man what if the water rose enough to like sink one console which console would I save and it was like my Xbox One uh, S or my Wii U and I decided to save my Wii U because the one how else will I be able to play my Wii U games and plus I can play the Wii games under without actually busting out the original Wii I have and two the reason why I decided to leave my Xbox S is because I have my original Xbox up here. So even though my brothers use it, I guess we have to go back to sharing it again. And yeah, that's it. I'm kind of go just rending off about random stuff now, but that's all I want to talk about. Just got to hurry up and get this video together so I can help my brothers fix the rest of the place up. And yeah, that's what I want to tell you guys today. So yeah, new video premiering later today. Hope you guys enjoy it. It's another part of the new Super Mario Bros. U series. And yeah, I'm Silverific. I'll see you on the next video. Goodbye.